Hello and welcome to this lecture. In this lecture, we build the actual GNS3 topology. So this is how it looks in the end. Now I will just drag it in the right. So let me just minimize it a little bit. If you have followed the steps in the GNS3 free course, you can see now in the server summary, your PC and also the GNS3 VM. So immediately, perfect. So in the server summary, the, the, green, circle, the green circle for the GNS3 VM and your PC. So now if you look on the right, you have the uh, all nodes for all devices uh, available and we will need the 48 firewall. I'll drag one. We will also need the virtual PC and I will put it to run in the GNS3 VM. This is the recommended way. We also need some uh, internet router. So this is the Cisco ISV. Perfect. And we need the Windows 10 machine. And I'll put it like this. Let me just check again. Perfect. Now let's do the, let's change something before we, uh, we actually uh, use, the, um, use the link tool. So you can just right click and say change hostname. And let's say this is the HQ port gate. And you know what, let's say right click and look for, so configure. I think there was, uh, there was an option. Yeah, here it is, change symbol. Let's say that this is a server. So server and apply and okay and change host name and say server and okay and this is going to be the internet router and let's just call it internet and windows 10 is fine now i will close this and use the add a link and I will just connect every device. So what did I use here? I used port two. And now I will use port one as the connection to the internet. I think it's gigabit zero by zero. It really doesn't matter, but anyway. Gigabit zero by one, which connects to first NIC card available. So not this one. So what you can do, just select it and say delete. And again, zero by one connecting to first NIC card. And because we also need management access to the FortiGate Pyrol, I could have used two Windows machines, one for the management and one for the testing uh, testing PC remote worker. But it makes no sense to um, uh, use that much memory. So I will just use two NIC cards on the Windows 10 uh, machine and I will connect it to the FortiGate firewall. So it, it means that port 3 in this case will be the management port. Well, opposed to as opposed to other vendors on the FortiGate firewall, any port can be the management port. It really depends on how you configure it. So you don't have a dedicated management uh, management port. So this is the um, this is the button that you can use in order to hide or show uh, the the interface names. So this is Ethernet one, Ethernet zero, NIC cards. Now, if you do, if you want to make it more uh, more visible to you and to provide some IP addresses so that you can uh, just uh, don't, do not switch before. Um, before configuring, uh, look again in the diagram. Maybe you have another diagram uh, uh, written down or created in, uh, in I don't know, in uh, in a PDF or something like that. You can just write here the subnet addresses on your own GNS3 topology, and I will just show you how to do it. I will not do it for for every uh, for every link. And as you can see, it's one and two, one six eight, one dot zero slash 24 
you can just uh, you can also just uh, change uh, font so let's say let's say text edit I will choose let's say red and apply and okay and as you can see it looks pretty much the same like the one uh, I have already created and it's ready to use in this course so not that uh, not that much to configure this is how it looks now that uh, you you know how to build your topology and we have done it together you are ready to start the the course and move to the next section where we will do the actual configuration so thanks a lot and see you in the next section and upcoming lectures